Where is Chris Hackett? Shut up. Wow. <laughs> Guys, she murdered Kaylee. We have been over this. I said shut up. You've done enough talking. Okay, so you talk. Say what you gotta say. You, Brian, maybe this is a bit much. I mean, just think about everything that's happened tonight. I'm not letting her kill Chris. No way. Not, not over some old-timey poem. It's not just the poem, though. It's everything. The kidnapping, two months locked up, for, for her boyfriend bursting into a thing. Like what happened to Nick. The longer we sit around questioning her motives, the longer Nick is out there. Jacob, Emma, we're all in danger. I believe her. This is what Shut she has up, to do. Shut up, Abby. Don't move. Your wrist. Stay away from her, I'll shoot. Silver, right? Uh, yeah. May I? What are you doing? I'm trying to help. Worst case scenario, this should give you a fighting chance. And this will kill them? For good? Yeah. But what if it's Nick or someone? Like I said, worst case scenario. Brian, put that fucking thing down before you hurt someone. So, come on. Where does Chris Hackett live? When he's not at camp, I mean. Even if I knew, I wouldn't tell you. Real mature. He's not in the storm shelter. I'm clearly getting nowhere hunting him in the woods. I need a place to start. I think that spooky house behind these woods. Dude! What? Listen, there could be another way. Have you thought about that? I've spent the last month thinking about nothing else. Look, when the sun comes up, I am stuck until the next full moon. So is Max, so is anyone else he's bitten. How is that our problem? Why don't you ask your friends in the woods? Don't forget about Nick, dude. Okay, any closer we're gonna have to spray you two with cold water. Ryan, let's just get out of here. I'm running out of time. If I can't find Chris Hackett, then a lot more people are going to get hurt. I'm going with you. What? what? Uh, yeah, what they said. I'm gonna show you that Chris Hackett has nothing to do with this. He wanted us to stay inside tonight. He wanted us safe. I don't care what you think. I don't care what you think. Shut up. Fine, do whatever you want. You saw what happened to Nick. He was bitten. Everything's gonna be fine. That cop car you stole, where is it? Ditched in the lake. Why? It was a stolen cop car. You're gonna have to try and fix the minivan. Get somewhere safe. How long do you have? An hour or two? I don't know. It doesn't seem like an exact science. Then we better get going. Are you sure this is the right way? Pretty sure, yeah. Pretty or definitely? What do I look like, a tour guide? This doesn't feel right. I think you're up to something. I'm not. You better not just be running out the clock. I'm not. The longer we're out here, the longer we're in danger. Said the murderer. You know, it might be a lot more pleasant if you lighten up a little. 
What is wrong with you? I've had kind of a fucked up summer. Yeah, well, doesn't kill you makes you stronger. Oh, what's that supposed to mean? I don't know. I, you're still alive, I guess. Nobody else needs to get hurt. An eye for an eye makes the whole world blind. No offense. I'm not doing this for revenge. I need to save Max. You're doing all of this for a boy? What am I supposed to do? Just leave him like this? I owe it to him. Like I said, kind of a fucked up summer. There it is. Back your house. So he lives in some redneck mansion with his redneck family in the ass crack of the woods? Look at this place. No, but it's where his mom lives, I think. Never been there. But if we're looking for answers, it's probably the best place to start. So, uh, wait, how do we get there? What do you mean? How do we get to the house? That's a really good question. Maybe we just don't. Will you stop protecting him? Whose side are you on? At this point, I have no fucking idea. There is a lot more to this than you realize. Like what? Kidnapping. Murder, cover-ups. I think the whole goddamn Hackett family is in on it. Maybe the whole camp, maybe even you, for all I know. Yeah, great. Just walk away. Oh, I'm sorry. I just figured that instead of standing around listening to you complain, I'd actually try to find another way across. <laughs> oh. died but we didn't it's nothing you'll be fine and you don't look delicious to me yet so I guess that means we still have time come on let's find a way up it's not funny it's a bit funny oh my god Laura Jesus Mary and jazz hands Here's a thought. What are you doing? Relax. Look. What big eyes you have, Grandma. No shit. Can you see yellow in my eyes? Define yellow? Shit. We haven't got much time. Did you hear that too? It's her. Who? The hag of Hackett's quarry. It's like she's warning us off. Or guiding us. Canada. 
This place is not up to code. I mean, if the code is literally crumbling to the ground, then I think it's doing fine. Let's just keep moving. Yeah. Careful. Jeez. Just look at this place. Boy, this is high. Whoa. A long way down. So what's your deal then? What do you mean? The whole mysterious brooding loner thing, it doesn't quite fit with the I love my camp leader vibe. So I don't fit into the right box, is that what you're saying? You know that's not what I mean. I've been coming here for years. You get to know a place and it feels like a second home, you know? I mean, until now. What about your friend, uh, Caitlin, is that her name? It seems like she looks up to you. Yeah, she... she has the hots for me. Dylan does too. Oh, modesty. Thy name is Ryan. I'm not being smug about it. It's just a fact. They're not exactly secretive about it. So, what about you? Who do you like more? I don't know. Maybe neither. This way, I see a light. Yeah. Or you can just hang out here, up to you. <sighs> Thanks for your help. You had it under control. Promising. You think this is it? Uh, beats me. I'm pretty much completely lost. <sighs> yeah, me too. Shall we?
What the hell happened here? Nothing good. We've got to keep moving. It's not safe here. Mr. H is going to be pissed. Look, honestly, if half of what Laura's saying is true, I really don't care what Mr. H thinks. What do you think happened to Jacob and Emma? Probably nothing. Hopefully. I mean, I mean should we go find them? Warn them? I think the safest thing, the most responsible thing, is to try and get help. Right. And then we can come back for them. And Nick. And Nick. There's something in there? I don't know. What is it? I... Jacob? Emma? Are they... Should I open it up? Your funeral, buddy. The silver. Use the silver shell. What if it's Nick? What if it isn't? Can you fix it? No. Oh. Not without some parts. Specifically, a rotor arm. There's a scrapyard up the road. So you can fix it? Well, no promises, but if there's hope, that's where we're gonna find it. That sounds like a long shot. Got something better to do? Not die? Yeah, I'd like that too, by getting the hell out of here. Okay, well, just because you're using logic to make sense doesn't mean that I'm totally into it. What about Abby? She'll be safer in the storm shelter. We don't all have to go. Agreed. Abby, we're going to the scrapyard to try to find anything that can help us get the hell out of here. Uh, okay, are you sure? It's fine. You stay here. You're safe in the storm shelter. You be careful. We will. What was that? Huh? What was that? Oh, it's nothing. We got we got guests downstairs. We don't want any more blood on our hands.
Jacob. Hey, it's Ryan. Jesus, what happened to you? It's electrified. Okay, um, there's a box in the corner of the room. I think that's how they're operated, okay? I saw this old guy, under dude from the woods. He used that. Why are you here, Travis? You ought to be out with the others. Like I say, we've been all night long trying to keep those kids safe. Uh, it's Kaylee. She's dead. <laughs> no. The boys are bringing her in right now. Now I know you got to screw loose in that cop head of yours. There ain't no way to kill her in her kind of condition. Silver bullet. She's dead, Ma. No. No, 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 not my granddaughter, not my own granddaughter, not my Kaylee, not my little Kaylee, not my little Kaylee, not my little Kaylee, you goddamn piece of shit, not my little Kaylee, God damn you, what did you do to her? Did you get bitten? Is she crazy? Wait! It's him! Think about it. Why would they lock him in a cage? And who the hell is it? Who the hell is she? She's in charge. You've already got it wrong once. It might even be Nick. Your friend? Hey, listen. Okay. They said that they've already got two of us accounted for. Whatever that means. Whoever this is, they're, they're not going anywhere. Remember? We've got to be sure. You promised. Fine. Fine. You gotta get me out of here. Okay, seriously. Don't They took it. They took it. You fucking idiot. Ma. God damn it. You fucking piece of shit. Get away. Get away from me. Okay, okay, okay. Talk me through it. Okay, so all I know is you have to open my door and that door. And definitely not that door. Oh, cool. Thanks, Detective. Okay, fuck you, man. I'm trying to help. No, fuck you. I'm trying to Shut up. Shut up. Okay, there's a console on the wall over there, like a box or whatever. You should be able to use those switches to isolate each cage. Okay. Hang tight. Okay. Done. Not just the middle one, dude. Don't fuck this up. I can do this. I can do this. Focus, dude. Focus. Damn. 
You look awful. Thanks. Hell. Where's everyone else? Um, Jake. Emma wasn't with them. I don't know where she is. But you should go catch up with them. Be careful. We came into the mines. I don't I don't know if there's a way back up. Not my, not, God, not, not my only granddaughter. Not my Kaylee. Not my little Kaylee. What? So, you, you had those motherfucking counselors in your goddamn jail for two whole motherfucking months, right? And you are telling me now that instead of putting a bullet into each one of their little sorry shit-stained brains? You, you gave them your silver bullet gun and they shot my Kaylee with it? Is that what you're telling me now, Travis? No more blood on your hands. That's what you, you, you said it. Oh, oh my God, we are way past that now. Oh, Ma, what, what if it had been me or, or, or Bobby? What then? She was your family. A good boy protects his family. You ain't no good boy. I wish I could take it all back. I wish I could take it all back, but I can't. Well, I just don't, I, I don't understand why you, you, you couldn't have just taken care of the problem when you had the chance. Taking care of the problem? Do you hear yourself? Yes, I hear my goddamn self. I may be old, but I ain't deaf. I'm a police officer! Oh, so now I'm blind, you motherfucker! Now I'm blind. Oh, you just flashing that badge around like it's worth a million dollars. The only reason you got it is because Hank got killed in the gypsy fire! Ma. Don't ma. Don't ma me. Do you sit down, please? Don't you tell me what to do. Please. And don't you go around. Don't you go around like you better than everybody else, because you ain't. Would you please sit down? Don't you tell me what to do, you... Piece of shit! Yes? Gotcha. <laughs> Ryan, run! Ma, send Bobby down. Her beauty is a tiger. Be careful, make sure that she doesn't bite. Her beauty is inside her. That's why I need to find the key tonight. When I say yes, you say no. Did you miss me? Hopefully, you brought me some more of my cards. Let's have a look, shall we? The Empress. Look at her. <laughs> Those at the top can fall the hardest. Such a shame to nurture little monsters, only to live long enough to watch them kill you. <laughs> But it's no less than she deserves. The lovers. There's harmony and disagreement. Brought to light only by sparks of passion. <laughs> Blood flows from the heart. You can almost taste it. And tasting it could save someone. The Wheel of Fortune. After all, fortune is nothing but a spinning wheel. 
Sometimes you have to take a chance. Karma works in mysterious ways, but it favors those who pay attention. Watch closely. Though the wheel spins, the eagle-eyed can tell where it's going to stop. The Emperor. Authority, paternity, stricter, is designed to topple, no? How the mighty may fall, and their empires with them. Let them bleed. Let them rip each other apart. Let them rot. Details. The choice is, and always has been, yours to make. Go. You've still got time. Be careful now. Be very careful. 